Good afternoon and evening, everyone. This is Terraqua Tour today. Welcome to Tuesday. It's Tuesday, August 6th, 2024. It's day 219. I took over for Tessa today. She she can have tomorrow. And part of it is, this is originally what I wanted to do yesterday, but you already saw that, well, I, I couldn't do anything yesterday. I was, I was not home. I was in the heat, and it was very hot. Even, and I'm I'm just glad I was, at the very least, I was kind of glad that I was able to do it yesterday instead of today. Because it's even hotter today. Heat in, the heat index is also higher today. So I'm just glad I don't need to go anywhere today. Hopefully. I'm hoping to just keep it where I don't have to go anywhere today. Because, uh, yeah, it's horrendously hot right now. And the AC cannot keep up. So no one in the house is happy right now. It's to be expected with this kind of heat. Uh, I mean, in a little bit, I could try cranking the heat down a little bit lower, but I can't really get it below 80 degrees Fahrenheit in the house right now. I've already I've already tried, and no, it wouldn't get any lower. I'll try again. It just means it's going to cost a whole lot more. But there isn't too much to talk about other than, yeah, still sober. I'm also preparing for an appointment I have tomorrow, so I have an appointment tomorrow, which hopefully it shouldn't interfere with doing these dailies, because uh, Tessa will be most displeased if it does. Uh, right now, we're dealing with a, um, a new growing issue in the house, where a certain sweet pea has figured out how to open all of the doors except for this door, because this door's jammed. But... Buttercup has taken it upon herself to believe that it's her job to keep Sweet Pea out of the rooms or anywhere, so she follows her everywhere and gets angrier. It gets frustrating because it's not her job. You know, Sweet Pea does need to explore even a little bit. But it's it's really she gets more and more frustrated, which gets her mother frustrated. It it like I, I guess what li what Lily struggles with is understanding um, sibling dynamics. This is very normal for siblings to get on each other's nerves, especially the younger sibling. Being a second child is a lot more rambunctious. I mean, I I want to say I was you know being a second born, I was more rambunctious than my brother, but we were both little boys. But I was also a middle child, so I was kind of a jerk as a child. I had my reasons. I just felt like, you know how it goes. But Sweet Pea's energy is beyond what Lilia ever expected for a toddler to have. I, but I, I, I kind of saw it coming. But eh, we'll try to get that dynamic dealt with. In an appropriate fashion, I suppose, is the easiest thing to say. But Buttercup is the one that definitely needs to learn that not everyone's going to behave like she does, which is in entirely normal, and that everyone has a different personality. And Sweet Pea is the one who's going to have to learn somewhere along the line to slow down. She'll get there, but, you know, she's gonna. She's almost three, so the amount of energy she has is to be expected. And Buttercup's situation is also understandable since she's going to be... Oh, lordy, she is going to be ten. She'll be ten soon. That's That's a fun one. But, other than that dynamic, that's the primary thing going on right now. So there's not a whole lot in the house other than the kids getting on each other's nerves, which is getting on Lily's nerves, too. They need time out of the house to do things beyond just being in the house. It's like any of the kids throughout the entire neighborhood, no one's going outside right now. It's too hot. So everyone's inside, which means anyone who has siblings, they're at each other's throats right now. They're ready to go back to school. I know Buttercup's definitely ready to go back to school, which is next week. 
uh, a week from tomorrow is when she goes back, so that yeah, should be good enough. And I'm, God, some it needs to be sometime this weekend. We need to get their, all of our school supplies taken care of because so far I haven't really been able to do a whole lot more than just wait. The situation's been mm, that's a good one. Mildly frustrating. That that's a good one. And yeah, I'm gonna do I'm gonna do fish tacos tonight. It's Taco Tuesday. I like my tacos, so I'm going to have some fish tacos. Says I, I am trying to be a little bit more healthy, but I will say, after everything we did, I had to do yesterday, and the fact I didn't really eat a whole lot yesterday because I was just I was too tired and weak to eat a whole lot yesterday. But I can definitely tell you, I am craving very fatty proteins right now. And I don't want to be eating a whole... Well, I definitely don't want to be eating too many carbohydrates. That's that's no that's no good. But I'll find something healthy. If only we could afford more salmon. I could use the omega-3s. But I, I, I got to make do somehow, yeah? And there isn't too much else going on. It's mostly the, the you know, s children bickering. Who, who, who here, who has siblings, I mean, I'm pretty sure if you have siblings, you, you've experienced that same kind of thing. Lilia's situation when she was a child was very different, which is why she's unfamiliar with such the, with such an experience. It's all familiar to me. I, I, I grew up in that kind of dynamic, so it's it's totally understandable. But Lilia, just so you know, this is a very normal thing for siblings to do. What Sweet Pea is doing is incredibly normal, especially since... <sighs> Sweet Pea has my childhood personality, which means nothing's going to stop her. She will find a way. Which means you have to learn how to... Well, you're going to have to find a way to, to uh, work that to your advantage a little bit and learn how to work around it. Because if you try to be a wall to her, she will find a way around the wall. It, it's an interesting dynamic, but you'll figure it out. But I'm keeping it there. I'm keeping it short today because there's not a whole lot going on. And it's, it's just really hot. The room is heating up faster and faster the longer I'm in here right now because, like I said, it is... Well, the heat index has it above 110 Fahrenheit right now, so... Yeah, it's, it's pretty hot in here right now. And in order to safely do any of this, I have to turn my ceiling fan off because it's like... Mm, about right here. Above my head. We have, we have short ceilings here. So, I'll just, I'll just leave it there. There's not really a whole lot to this world to explain. It's a very small world. It's very small. You can't even really swim in the pool that's back here. It's a very, it's, it's very short. So, again, not a whole lot else to go on about. It's just Tuesday. I hate Tuesdays, but I decided to get it out of the way because I had to beat myself up getting to Buttercup School yesterday, so I took over for Tessa. I took the Tuesday, which means you're not going to get the word she likes. Sorry, everyone, but this is... This is Tuesday, August 6th, 2024. Day 219. We will... We will see you all tomorrow. It's still going to be VR. We'll figure out if it's going to be late or not because of my appointment is anywhere between 4 o'clock... Or not 4 o'clock, anywhere between noon and 4 p.m. tomorrow. But other than that, we will see you all tomorrow. See ya.